Well, I'm having trouble, y'all. <laughs> I'm having some trouble with my uh, with my camera. I'm gonna see if I can get this straightened out here. It's one of these late night things. Sometimes it doesn't always work out right. All right, let's see. Let me. Uh... All right, I'm gonna have to turn this thing off. See if I can. That camera is definitely, definitely not working. All right, I'm to unplug it and plug it back in. Yeah, technical issues on a live, not the best thing in the world. So, oh, there we go. All right, we are in the building. <laughs> All right, everyone, so there we go. We finally are back in here. Had some technical issues, but we have it all worked out, hopefully there. So, uh, you know what, let me grab, I need a pocket knife today. So, let's go with, uh, let's go with my SOG Terminus XR. There we go, that's one of my new knives. If anybody saw this uh, last, a uh, couple weeks ago, this is one that I, uh, that I got a, uh, a couple weeks ago that I did. And uh, I'm still working out the details of getting this thing open. It has a flipper, but it's sort of sticky. It doesn't really, I haven't really been using it much because everything's super tight on here. It's, it's hard to get this thing open when I need it open. And the, uh, and the clip on here is too tight on my pocket. I can get it on my pocket, but I can't get it off my pocket quickly. That bothers me, so I just haven't really been using it all that often, so. All right. Well, first of all, shout out to those that are in the building. I see Pedro in the house says, hi, Larry. Uh, everyone, hit that thumbs up and show Larry some uh, support to his channel. Thank you so much for that. I definitely appreciate it. And uh, thanks to the other folks that are in the room. I think there's like six right now. So if I can get six likes, that would be fantastic. All right, well, let's get this thing started. I only have like four packages and um, I was waiting for one that didn't get here until very late and then I had to eat dinner and then I did another live stream with somebody else. They got away from me. So I was, I was gonna do this tomorrow, but I decided let me get this done today and, uh, and get it out of the way and just have some fun with it. Even if it's late, you know, my late night crew will be with me and everybody else, well, they can watch the replay, so. Anyways, there you go. Shout out to Evil Witch says, hi, Larry. I was wondering uh, why you didn't do your weekly haul. Yeah, that's why. Just I was waiting for a package. It didn't get here until late. And then, you know, the rest of the day went by. So, all right. I'm going to do something different this weekly haul. I'm just going to open packages in the order that I got them. And I got this one first. So I don't know uh, what's in here. But it's from Amazon, so, oh, look at that. I actually got that thing open. Do you see that? I got it I got it flicked open quickly, so I'm getting used to it, I guess. All right, let's get this one open, and um, and let's see what this, uh, what's in here. And let's see here. What we what did we get from Amazon? Oh, there's a couple things in here. All right, look at this. All right, nice way to start off. We have a couple of cameras. All right, we have... Uh, looks like it says Altruit, Altruit digital camera. And it says it has a 48 megapixel sensor, 16X digital zoom, 2.7 2 inch um, LCD screen. Look at that, let me just show you guys right here. You can check that out. And um, yeah, it says it has autofocus, macro, and uh, double, double shutter. So, huh, this looks like it could be kind of cool. Let me see, I think the tape is off this one here, so maybe I can open it up. I'm gonna do a proper unboxing of this thing and uh, and review one of them and then give the other one away since they sent me two of them. But there we have it. We can see we're going to get a, uh, a user's manual in there. We are going to get, look at that, not just one, but, uh, but two batteries. Very nice. I love when they do that because some of these cameras are not like, they're not big name cameras. They're not big brand cameras. You can't just roll up into Best Buy or your local camera shop and get a battery for this camera. So it's important that they give you two batteries when they ship them. So big ups to them for that. All right, looks like we're going to get a USB, uh, micro USB cable. So eh, it is what it is. I wish everything was USB-C. Um, we have a, uh, a little wrist, uh, wrist lanyard there so you can put that on your wrist. Um, it looks like this is going to be, let's see, what is this going to be? This is going to be, oh, a, um, a power brick. So you can actually plug the cable in. So, you know, just 
note to everyone else out there that's not putting power bricks in their stuff. People still need power bricks for their uh, for their devices. So, all right, shout out to them for, for doing that. And then here is the, uh, the camera. And let's take that out. And look at that. Pretty cool looking little camera. All right. Now, I don't know how this thing is going to perform at all. I'm going to have to go ahead and, uh, and try it out and see. There is a screen here on the back, as you can see. So there's that. And um, they even give us a little, um, they even gave us a little pouch that we can put the camera in. So very nice. Um, yeah. Well, this is going to be fun. Now, I'm not expecting the greatest of uh, anything from this camera. It's a very inexpensive camera. This is not like it is a fancy uh, Sony or Canon or Panasonic or something or Nikon. It's just a little small Amazon camera that hopefully outperforms my expectations. So we'll see. But um, yeah, let me see if I can, um, let me get everything back in here and let me see if I can actually find a, uh, a barcode for this thing and and see if I can find it. Oh, yep, there is. There is a barcode on the back. Let me see if I can get this thing pulled up and I will show you, if it'll scan, I'll show you what it cost and, and what it looks like on the Amazon um, on the Amazon site there. Let me see if I can, let me try this one more time. Doesn't seem like it's scanning right away. Let me see if I can move it a little bit closer. Nope, let me try this, let me get it. Looks like I had the barcode upside down. I don't think that should really matter, but let me just try it anyway. So, yeah, it doesn't seem like it's, uh, doesn't seem like it wants to scan. All right, well, let me see if I can find it. I, I think I had this thing in my, I think I had it in my list here, the stuff I was shopping for, but I was looking for, uh, I was looking for some other stuff and I look at uh, someone, the people who sent me this, this camera asked me about it. And um, yeah, let me uh, let me see if I can let me see if I pull this up here on the web, and this is going to be the the Alt Truit digital camera. All right, there we go. That's a little, that's a little bug or something jumped on me for a second there. All right, I think this is that is not it right there. That is not it either. Oh, here it is right here. The ultra. Oh, it's a kid's camera. Look at that. All right. It is a kid's camera. So the Altruit digital uh, kids digital camera, 16x digital zoom, uh, 48 megapixel, uh, 4K uh, HD selfie camera for boys, girls, teens, adults, uh, beginners, elderly, portable, compact student camera, 2.7 inches. Uh, on the screen, deep black. Yeah, look at that. It looks like they also have a pink one. And I have, um, oh, look at that. I actually do have one black and one pink. So I may have to figure out which one I'm gonna review and which one I'm gonna give away. Um, it looks like you can also use this as a webcam if you need this as a webcam. Um, it has, again, 16X digital zoom. Um, it has far and macro mode, so you can use that zoom or you can get nice and close with the macro. Um, you have, uh, looks like they take everything you're gonna get in here, the two batteries, the plug, the user manual, the uh, hanging rope, that sounds ominous, <laughs> uh, camera bag, and USB uh, data cable. So yeah, and then there you have it. Um, there's some other stuff about it there. It's like smile detection, there's anti-shake, smile detection, computer connect and all that good stuff there. So yeah, that's it. And it is $58.99 and you can get this with prime delivery one day. You can actually get this tomorrow if you order it the next eight hours and nine minutes from at least from where I'm at, you can actually get this delivered tomorrow. So big ups to them. All right, well, I'm gonna, um, I'm going to actually review this later. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, set this aside so that uh, so that I can see how this thing performs and if it's any good. So it could be fun. I think it's kind of fun. They gave, uh, there's two colors. There's black and pink that they sent me. So it should be uh, fun seeing those two. So, all right, let's go on to the next one. The next one that I received, since I'm gonna go in the order that I received these packages this week, is this one here. And this one, I think they just wrapped it in here because I see the Amazon uh, sticker actually on the box there, I mean, on the packaging there. So I'm gonna go ahead and scan this. Um, I'm gonna scan this before I open, take the plastic off. It makes it a little bit easier sometimes to get in there. And this one actually scanned 
Oh, look at that. This is another camera. This is this one here is an action camera here. So let me go, let me jump back in here. And um, let me jump back into my um, into my Amazon app here. And let me see, let me go back into my browser. And here we go, let me show you. This is gonna be it right here. This is the X-Pro Trek 4K uh, action camera with touchscreen, EIS, uh, or electronic image stabilization, uh, adjustable uh, view angle, 40, 40 meter waterproof uh, underwater camera, remote sports control camera with helmet uh, accessory kit. So. And it's only $102.67. So if you're looking for an action camera and you don't have all that crazy GoPro money or DJI money, this might be a good option for you. So um, again, you see it says it's going to have um, touchscreen. It's going to have touchscreen control. And that's going to be, that's going to look of it with, the, with it in the underwater housing there. So we can see there, it says it's going to have electronic image stabilization. Um, it's going to have the dual... Uh, I'm not sure what that word is, Bilkram, dual Bilkram, uh, two, two Zoll IPS touchscreen. No, I think that's in German. Maybe that's what it is. All right. And then, yeah, all those were all that, uh, all these graphics are in German for some reason. They must have pulled these graphics from their German Amazon listing. So, but you can see here, it's kind of cool. You can see how he's wearing that remote so he can actually, uh, start and stop the, uh, the, uh, camera action from his wrist. Now, I don't know where this camera supposedly is that, that they're taking this photo. I don't think they are trying to show that this ca the camera took this photo. I think they're just showing that um, that it's on his wrist, unless the camera's mounted to like a boat or something, because it does look like he's maybe on like a wakeboard or something. So, all right, you can see there. Uh, again, I can't read any of this text because all this text is all looking like it's in German there. So, but here's everything that's going to come with it here. The, um, and I'm going to do a proper unboxing so we can see what this uh, camera looks like and all the accessories look like and everything. So we'll, we'll get to that when I do the actual, um, the actual review. But again, it's 10267 there. So yeah. All right. And that is, um, and let's go ahead and, uh, that, that is, that is from, I believe it's, uh, I think it's Akasa, Akaso, Akasa. Anyways, let's uh, let's go ahead and get this thing open here, and uh, and see what this thing is going to look like. It looks like we have a couple more people that came through here. So there we go. Um, let's see here. We'll get to them. We'll show, I'll pop them up on the screen in just a moment. But there we go. The X Pro, the uh, X Pro Trek. UHD 4K action camera right there. Look at that. All right. There we have it. We can see that. And yeah, when I look on the back even, I can't read any of the stuff on the back. Um, it looks like on the back here, it's all in, uh, it's all in German. All the letters, all the writing stuff is German back there. So um, yeah. Um, one thing I do like about this so far is um, as you can see on the front there, it looks like this has dual displays so that you can uh, you can see yourself from the front. So if you're using this as a vlogging camera, you'll be able to actually uh, see yourself. So, um, you know, I don't really do much action sports. I don't do many action sports, but I do like to use small cameras to vlog with. And so um, one thing I do like to, to know is that um, there is a front facing screen and another thing that's important with these types of cameras is if it has a quarter 20 thread on the on the camera so that I can mount it on a mini tripod or something without having the, the underwater housing because the underwater housing destroys the audio. And so if I can do that, if I have a way to mount it to a mini tripod without the housing, that's fantastic. And actually, I don't think I, you know, with these housings, I don't even need to take the camera. I don't need to take the, uh, the mount off. I just need to take it the camera out of the housing. So let's get this out and let's see if it actually has, and it does, look at that. Right on the bottom of the camera there, you can see we have a mini, I uh, mean, excuse me, a quarter 20 thread um, tripod mount. So we can actually mount this um, on a tripod or a selfie stick or something without the underwater housing. And so 
this is gonna be great because if I wanna vlog with this, now I can get much better audio straight out of the camera. So shout out to them for that. That's I, I, I like that they're thinking ahead like that. So, all right. I'm not going to unbox all of this because I am going to, uh, because I am going to do a proper unboxing of this later, but I'm gonna put this stuff back in there. And that is the, uh, that is the X-Pro UH, uh, UHD 4K action camera. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna review this thing pretty soon. I'm looking forward to this actually. So shout out to them for sending that. All right, and again, if you want this camera, you can get this, uh, you can get this bad boy for a, um, you can get this for $102.67, so big ups. And you get all this stuff with it. You're gonna get all kinds of mounts and, and you're gonna get a remote and extra battery and all that kind of good stuff there. Underwater housing, you're gonna get all kinds of great stuff there. So shout out to them. All right, let's see here. Let's see, we have Gigi in the building. Shout out says, hello Larry, happy Friday. I hope you all had a great week, yes. Big ups to you, and uh, I hope you had a great week as well, and I hope you have a fantastic weekend. So, all right, we have Blue Sandy in the house saying, hi, Larry. Shout out to you, Blue Sandy. Big ups. All right. Um, the next package that I received this week is this one, which I have no idea what it is. Not a clue, uh, but it is an Amazon package, and it's easy to get into because it's uh, one of these envelopes, so let me do that. Usually I open these envelopes uh, first, but I decided I'm gonna do, I'm gonna open everything in order that I received them today. So, all right, we have a couple of, uh, we have a couple of devices from Unbreak Cable. So, from Unbreak Cable. And um, let's see what shows on here on the packing list. It looks like we have a Bluetooth 5.0 FM transmitter for the car, and we have a, uh, a iPhone car charger. So shout out to them. Look at that. All right. Well, there's the box. Their boxes are always pretty, uh, just pretty nondescript, which I actually like. Um, they just, you know, they don't really put a ton of money into their packaging, which I think is great. It helps keep the price down of the over of the actual product. So let's see if we can get this thing to scan. And we did. All right. We have one that's scanned. And let's see if we can get the other one to scan. And then I'll pull them both up on the... Um, from my browsing history, so. All right, yep, there is the other one. All right, cool, let's go ahead and um, let's go ahead and pull up the browser again and let's go into my browsing history and here is one. This is the iPhone car charger from Unbreak Cable and uh, this is going to be an Apple certified cigarette, uh, phone cigarette charger lighter there. So you can see there, it's gonna work for pretty much all of them. It's gonna work for the 13, 12, 11, XS, XS Max, XR, X, iPad, and more. So there you go. It is a lightning cable, so pretty much anything that has a lightning should work with this. And it's gonna be 19, uh, 1989. And we can get an idea what this is going to look like. So you can see it says upgraded Apple certified uh, M5 chip to uh, C89, made for iPhone, iPad, and iPod. And we can see there it's going to have smart chip protection. So you're going to have overcurrent protection, temperature control, short circuit protection, over voltage protection, and overcharge protection. And you can see there it says dual high speed charging. So you can get that going. It's going to be safe, convenient, and fast. And then right here, you can see it says broad compatibility with phones and uh, vehicles. So it's gonna work on all kinds of different stuff. So, and then you can see there what it's gonna look like. It says built-in flexible lightning cable and compact size and weight. And yeah, so, all right. And then let's take a look at the, uh, let's take a look at the other one here and then we'll, open, we'll get them out of the box and take a look at them. And here we go, this is the Unbreak Cable uh, Bluetooth 5.0 FM transmitter for car. Sorry, Oops. could you say that again? Oops. My, uh, my Apple Watch, Siri thought I was trying to talk to her. <laughs> so there we go, the Unbreak Cable FM, um, FM uh, transmitter for a car. And this one's $24.99, and we can see here, this is gonna have a QC3 uh, fast charger, a PD 20 watt fast charger, look at that, that's nice. We're gonna have a, also a 
another thumb drive, a USB port, so that you can put in music. So you can plug in a thumb drive or a little, uh, a little mini hard drive or something to that effect that will have music on there. You have a button there for the phone, and then I'm not sure what this other button is for there, but you, have, you can see that you have, uh, it looks like there's gonna be a speaker here as well if you want to use, I think that's gonna be if you wanted to use a speaker or if you, maybe it's also for a microphone if you want to use it for, um, <coughs> excuse me, to make phone calls or to maybe use your personal assistant. And on the side, there's a power button and a channel button so you can actually change the channel. So, yeah. All right, we can see here it says uh, it says protect driver safety and joy it says joystick operation so that's nice right there. Um, we can see it says hyper stable connection with Bluetooth 5.0. Um, it says hands free calls, voice navigation, drive straight 200 meters. Out. So yeah, so that's going to give you the voice navigation out of there if you wanted to. But you can also hook it up via the the, the uh, car with the FM transmitter and have this going through your car stereo system. So um, yeah, it says uh, says one key uh, one key uh, open powerful bass. Oh, so I see right there. So that's going to give you a bass boost if you want to get more bass playing through your music. So if you have your music going through this through to your car stereo system, that's going to give you a nice bass boost right there. Um, and then you can see right there, it's going to have uh, PD 20 watt Type C uh, and QC 3.0 fast charging. So it's going to give you either 50%. Uh, 50% faster on the QC3 and 80% faster on the PD charger. So that's nice. If you have something that, that requires PD charging, maybe like a tablet or um, a camera or something, that's going to be nice to have in the car. And it says universal compatibility. It's going to work pretty much with all cars. You don't have to really worry about it. You can work use it with pretty much with all cars. And it says dynamic LED um, atmosphere light. So yeah. And this again, this is only 24 99 so big ups all right let's go ahead let's take this let's see what this thing looks like let's try this one first i think this one is uh i think this might be the cable let's see what the cable is gonna look like um let's get this out oh no this is actually the fm transmitter so let's get this out of there let's see what this is gonna look like in real life yeah that's really small that's nice. That is that's nice and small. It definitely has that joystick. Let me see if I can get this in there so you can see that. So that is uh that looks pretty nice there. And let me see if I can get my get my camera to focus on this thing. And yeah, that is uh that's kind of cool. So um it's definitely um it's definitely easy. It feels like it's easy to operate with that little joystick. That looks kind of nice. So I, I like that a lot. So it looks good. So Okay, and then let's see what the um, let's see what the cable is going to look like in in the real world here. And uh, let's see if I can cut through this cut through this tape. There we go. All right, and get this out. And oh, there we go. Oh, there's something else in there too. What is this? Um. Oh, they gave us a user manual, I guess it is. So, uh, yeah, I think that's a user manual. Is that what that is? Um, oh, it's a little thank you card. So there's a thank you card. This is a warranty card. It says activate your warranty now. It says there's a, uh, there is a 36-month warranty that you can get on there if you activate your warranty. And then let's get this thing out of here. I'll tell you, they, they really package this thing up. So... There you go. That's it, right? Oh, look at this. I did not realize this. This is very cool. So on this thing, you can see you have your you have your DC uh, port, your your uh, your cigarette lighter port, and then on this thing you have a lightning cable that you can use to plug in. But if you notice here on this side as well, you may notice. Let me see if I can get that in focus. There's actually a um, there's actually a USB port on there so that you can actually plug in another. Um, you can plug in another device. So let's say if you wanted to plug in, um, let's say that you had both an iPhone and an Android phone like I have. I carry both an Android phone and an iPhone. So let's say that you plug this in, you can go ahead and plug this in, plug this into your iPhone and then plug the other end into your, um, plug a cable like a USB-C cable into here, USB-A to USB-C, 
and then plug that into your Android phone and then you can charge both of them at the same time. So yeah, pretty nice. I have to say, I like that. That's kind of cool. All right, let me set all this stuff off to the side here and um, and big ups to Unbreak Cable for sending that out. That was, uh, that was very dope of them. Um, they have some really great products over there at, uh, at Unbreak Cable. If you guys need some, uh, if you need a great Father's Day gift, something that is going to work for your dad for a long time, that they make really nice products. So, all right, let's see here. Um, let's see, what else do we have? Let's get, uh, let's get this one open. This is our last one because this is the last one to arrive this week. So. Let me go ahead and cut through this and my knife is doing really nicely. I'm gonna have to clean it because it has a little bit of a, it has a little bit of stuff on there. I think it's, uh, it's got a little, you might be able to see the blade has a little bit of gunk on there. So let's see if I can get that in focus. I'll tell you, my camera is like super sticky on my face today. There you go. But there's a little stuff on the knife right there. I'm gonna have to clean it because I haven't reviewed this yet and I plan on making a bit of a review on it. So, all right, let's get this thing. Let's get this thing going and all right, look at this. This is from Pixel and uh, this is the Pixel uh, tube light. It says LED full color tube light. It's uh, the Feroz, the Feroz, um, I guess that's the model number, the, for, the Feroz. And it is, it says lighting control system and there is a, there is a Amazon code on here, so let me scan this thing and see if it comes up. And so I can pull it up in, in, all right, there we go, it's coming up. And yeah, all right, let me go ahead into my, uh, let me go into my browsing history here. And there we go, all right, there it is. And this is it right here. This is the RGB handheld uh, light wand, pixel LED uh, video light with, um, with app control, 16 million colors, tube light for photography. Uh, you can dim it from 20, uh, it says dimming, 2500 uh, ke uh, Kelvin to 8500 Kelvin, light stick, OLED display with 10 light effects. So there you have that. And it's uh, 55, 99 right now and you can actually save another five percent by applying um, that coupon right there so yeah there you go now you can see uh, you can see here it's going to have the uh, app control so you can see you can mount this thing on a uh, on a, a light stand if you want and you see the little uh, the little wireless symbol up there because it's going to have app control so you can use it with the pixel uh, lcs um, you know, wireless control, it's gonna have, IO, it's gonna work for iOS and Android. And then you can see it's gonna have all the colors that you want right there. It's gonna have, um, it's gonna have the full 360 degree color range right there and all these RGB colors. So it's gonna, it's gonna look fantastic. And then you can see there, you can, uh, it has, uh, it has three sided, uh, three sided magnetic absorption so that you can stick this uh, light in all kinds of places. So you can see here how they have it mounted up on the, um, on the railing there of this fence. And then they have another one over here mounted up so that they get sort of like this, uh, you know, light that's accenting her and hitting her on both sides there. So that's kind of cool, especially if you are, um, if you're out shooting in some unconventional places, it's really helpful to have that magnetic connection there. All right, let's see here. It says 10 kinds of scene effects. So you're gonna get all kinds of different scene effects here. Oops, where'd it go? There you go. You're gonna be able to get lightning one, lightning two, TV screen, uh, police car, fire engine, ambulance, fast RGB, slow RGB, SOS, and candlelight. So big ups. And then you can see here some of the dimensions of the tube. Uh, you can see there's gonna be a power switch, a select uh, button, type C interface, quarter 20 screw, um, OLED screen, mode setting button, uh, long press course and fine adjustment uh, button uh, and all that stuff there. And you can see what the, what the uh, actual LEDs are gonna look like in there. So yeah, this thing looks pretty cool. And again, it's $55.99 and you can get 5% off with the, uh, with the coupon that is on there. So this looks like a pretty awesome light uh, to have. So um, I'm not actually going to open this light right now because I'm going to do a, uh, a full review of this light because 
I think this thing might actually be pretty cool to use. So I'm gonna do a full review of it. Um, but you can kind of get an idea of what the of what the packaging looks like there. You can check that out. You can see there it's gonna say on the back like scene effects and RGB and, and all that good stuff there. So yeah, I'm looking forward to trying this thing out. And this again is from uh, from Pixel. And it's, uh, it's like $55.99 with another 5% off on Amazon right now. So, yeah. All right. Well, I did pretty well today. For I mean, I only had four products, but I have been wanting to do more photography and video related products. And so this week has been actually really good because I have two cameras and a video light. And so, yeah, they're not the biggest name cameras or any name cameras, um, but... I'm moving on up, I hopefully, slowly but surely. Hopefully I'll get some more cameras in and some more and some more and some more. And maybe the next thing you know, I'll get a free Canon that I can I can use to to, to feature and, and to review. Maybe I'll get another Nikon or a Sony or whatever. Hopefully I'll just keep getting new cameras in and I can review more and more cameras and help people find the right camera that's going to work for them for whatever their usage, whether it be just hanging out on the weekends, or taking photos of your friends or family or art project or starting a YouTube channel, whatever it is. Hopefully I can find the right cameras, review them and help you find the right camera for yourself. So yeah. All right. All right. Well, that is it. I am up out of here. It is late. It is almost one o'clock. I um. I, again, didn't have that much to, to review today, but I thank everyone who came out to hang out and my late night, uh, my late night live stream, and uh, it's been fun. Thank you. First of all, I, I want to give a big shout out to uh, to Pedro Villanova because he hits me up and asks me if I'm doing my uh, my weekly haul video, and um, and sometimes I'm not motivated. Sometimes I am not motivated, and it can be hard to get going. And so when you guys send me messages, whether it be on Facebook or Instagram or Twitter or, or whatever platform, you know, it's sometimes it's very, very motivating to know that somebody's actually out there waiting for your video, looking forward to your video. And, and sometimes that's all you need is just a, just somebody asking about it to give you a little swift kick in the butt to get up off your, off your duff and go and go get it done. And so big ups to Pedro for, uh, for keeping me motivated. Thank you, bro. All right. Let's see here. Let me give um, let me give this one to uh, let me give this one to Pedro. Here you go, man. I don't have friends. I got family. All right, all right, all right. Okay, well, I am up out of this piece. I am uh, I'm gonna go on and go to bed because it's getting late. Well, actually, I'm gonna go probably shoot another video and then I'm gonna go to bed. So. Um, thank you so much. Shout out to Gigi in the building. Say having a great weekend. Thank you much. I will. Thanks, Evil Witch, for coming through. Thanks to everybody else who came through, too. So, all right, y'all. I'm out. Have a good weekend. And until next time, I am Larry.